Before we begin, let's be absolutely clear. This is not a guide for hacking, spying, or causing harm to anyone. We do not condone or encourage any illegal activity, and nothing you see here should be used to break the law or invade someone's privacy. Everything we discuss is strictly for your protection. Let's get started. We treat our text messages like private diaries, pouring our secrets, plans, and daily thoughts into them without a second thought. It feels natural to assume that what we type is for our eyes only, locked away behind a password or fingerprint. But the reality is, they're not as secure as we think. The sense of privacy we feel is often just an illusion, and the protections we rely on can be surprisingly fragile. Hackers see your SMS inbox as a gold mine, banking info, passwords, even two-factor codes. Every message you send or receive could be a valuable clue, a stepping stone to something bigger. And here's the scary part, they don't need your phone in hand. With the right tools, they can access your texts remotely, from anywhere in the world, slipping past your defenses without you ever noticing. You might never know you've been compromised until it's too late. By the time you notice something's wrong, the damage could already be done. Your information stolen, your privacy shattered, your private conversations, security codes, and personal data could all be siphoned off invisibly, leaving no trace behind. Hackers can intercept messages, clone your SIM card, or exploit software vulnerabilities to get what they want. Every message is a puzzle piece for a hacker to build a profile of you. They can piece together your habits, your contacts, even your routines, all from the fragments you leave behind in your texts. With enough info, they can steal your identity, drain your accounts, or blackmail you. The consequences go far beyond embarrassment. They can impact your finances, your reputation, and your peace of mind. The privacy of your SMS is about more than just secret chats. It's the foundation of your digital life. If your texts aren't safe, neither are your online accounts, your money, or your personal relationships. We need to stop trusting our phones as impenetrable fortresses. Even the latest devices have flaws, and no system is completely immune to attack. Vulnerabilities exist, and criminals know how to exploit them. They're always searching for new ways in, and they only need to succeed once. The good news? You can make it much harder for anyone to get in. Simple steps like updating your software, using strong passwords, and enabling two-factor authentication can make a real difference. But first, you need to know the enemy's playbook. Understanding how these attacks work is the first step to protecting yourself. Let's look at one of the most common ways hackers trick you into handing over the keys. It's called phishing, and it's more convincing than ever. It starts with a simple, deceptive message. Maybe it looks like it's from your bank, a delivery service, or even a friend. But one wrong tap can open the door to your entire digital world. Don't assume your texts are safe. Assume they're a target. Treat every unexpected message with caution, and never share sensitive info unless you're absolutely sure who you're talking to. Awareness is your first line of defense. The more you know, the better you can protect yourself and those you care about. Let's dive into how these attacks work, so you can spot the warning signs and stay one step ahead. Phishing, especially via SMS or smishing, is a classic hacker move. You get a message that looks urgent, maybe your bank, a delivery, or a refund. The goal? Make you click a link without thinking. That link leads to a fake site, nearly identical to the real one. Enter your info and you've handed it straight to the hacker. Sometimes the link installs spyware on your phone, giving hackers real-time access to your texts. One click, and your private life is exposed. The best defense? Skepticism. Don't trust urgent messages or unfamiliar links. Always verify by going directly to the official website or calling the company. Never click a link in a text unless you're absolutely sure it's legit. Hackers rely on your quick reaction. Slow down and double-check. That pause could save your digital life. SIM swapping is a sneaky attack that targets your phone's identity, specifically, your SIM card, which is the tiny chip inside your phone that connects you to your mobile network and proves who you are to your provider. Hackers use clever tricks and social engineering to convince your mobile provider to transfer your phone number to a SIM card they control, often by pretending to be you. Suddenly, your phone loses service without warning. While you're left wondering what happened, the hacker now receives all your calls and texts, cutting you off from your digital life. To pull this off, they often gather personal information about you from social media, data breaches, or previous hacks. With enough details, they can easily impersonate you when contacting your provider. The real danger begins when they intercept your two-factor authentication codes. With access to these codes, they can break into your email, social media, and even financial accounts, 
taking over your digital identity. In just minutes, they can drain your bank accounts, lock you out of your own services, and steal sensitive data before you even realize something is wrong. The damage can be devastating and difficult to reverse. To protect yourself, add a unique PIN or password to your mobile account. This extra layer of security makes it much harder for hackers to impersonate you, even if they have some of your personal information. Be mindful of what you share online. Limit the amount of personal information you post on social media, and review your privacy settings regularly to make it harder for hackers to gather details about you. If your phone suddenly loses service for no reason, don't ignore it. Contact your provider immediately from another device to check if your number has been transferred without your permission. SIM swaps can be devastating, but a few proactive steps, like securing your account and staying alert, can stop them before they start. Don't wait until you become a victim. Take action now to secure your phone number and protect your digital identity. Remember, your phone number is a digital key to your life. Guard it fiercely and don't let anyone steal your identity. Spyware is like a hidden camera in your pocket, recording everything undetected. Once installed, it monitors your calls, texts, location, and more, sending it all to a hacker. Spyware sneaks in through malicious links, shady apps, or even brief physical access. Trojan horse apps from unofficial stores are a common culprit. Good spyware is invisible. No pop-ups, no slowdowns, nothing to tip you off. It can watch you for weeks before you notice anything wrong. To protect yourself, only download apps from official stores. Be wary of apps asking for unnecessary permissions. Keep your phone and apps updated. Patches fix security holes. Use a reputable mobile security app to scan for threats. Treat your phone like your home. Don't let strangers in and check the locks often. Vigilance is your best defense against invisible threats. Don't make it easy for a silent watcher to move in. Most hacks aren't about fancy tech. They're about manipulating people. Social engineering is the hacker's real weapon, tricking you into giving up secrets. They might pose as tech support, your boss, or a trusted company. The story is always urgent, personal, and convincing. Hackers study your social media to craft believable lures, concert tickets, job offers, anything tailored to you. The best defense? Skepticism and verification. Don't trust requests for sensitive info. Always confirm through a separate, trusted channel. If tech support calls, hang up and call the official number. If your boss emails about money, check in person or by phone. Hackers rely on your impulse. Pause, question, and verify. Social engineering only works if you let your guard down. Stay alert, and you'll outsmart the con. If a hacker gets your SMS, it's not just your chats at risk, it's your whole digital life. They can access your bank, steal your money, and apply for loans in your name. Identity theft becomes easy with the info in your texts, addresses, reset links, personal details, the fallout, financial loss, ruined credit, and endless stress. Hackers can blackmail you with private conversations or threaten to expose sensitive info. The emotional toll is real. Anxiety, fear, and a sense of violation. Worse, your compromised phone can be used to attack your friends and family. Hackers send phishing links from your number, spreading the infection. Your breach doesn't just hurt you, it ripples out to everyone you know. The stakes are high, and the damage can last for years. Protecting your texts protects your entire network. Don't underestimate the consequences. One breach can change everything. Now, let's talk solutions. Awareness is your first wall. Be skeptical of unsolicited messages and urgent requests. Always verify through a separate channel before acting. Move away from SMS for two-factor authentication. Use authenticator apps instead. These apps generate codes on your device, not tied to your phone number. Keep your phone and apps updated. Security patches close vulnerabilities. Install a reputable mobile security app to scan for threats. Secure your mobile account with a strong PIN or port out password. This extra step blocks SIM swaps. By layering these defenses, you build a digital fortress. Don't just hope for safety, create it step by step. Your actions today can keep hackers out tomorrow. Make security a habit, not an afterthought. We've explored the dark side of digital life, but knowledge is your shield. Hackers rely on your ignorance. Now you know better. Security isn't a one-time fix. It's an ongoing practice. Stay alert to new threats and keep your defenses updated. Make strong passwords and two-factor authentication part of your routine. Share what you've learned. Help friends and family stay safe too. Most people still think they're not targets. Prove them wrong by being prepared. Your awareness can protect your whole community. Don't fear technology. Use it wisely and confidently. 
You're in control now. Stay informed, stay alert, and stay one step ahead. Your digital life is yours. Keep it that way. Be safe out there.